how to watch three network video recorders on a single TV. We had three network video recorders and a 55-inch large TV. We want to combine the HDMI output from the three network video recorders into a single channel and display all three network video recorders on this TV. First, let's see what we have in this setup. We have three IP cameras that connect to this PoE switch and the PoE switch provides the power to these three cameras. And we have three network video recorders. They are also connect to the same PoE switch so we can have the live video from the camera on these three network video recorders. In order to combine the video from these three network video recorders, we do need another device called Multi-NVR Viewer. This is the four channel multiple NVR viewers. It has four HDMI input ports and one HDMI output port. We will connect the cable from the TV to this HDMI output port and connect those three network video recorders to this HDMI input port. Now let's get started. First, I need to power up this multi NVR viewer. It takes the DC low voltage power input. Next, let's connect the HDMI cable from the TV to this HDMI output port. The multi NVR viewer will combine the video source from these four input port. Then into a single output port, we have attached the TV to this output port. Let's work on the input port. I use this HDMI cable to connect the port number one to one of our network video recorder. Let me turn on the TV. This is the video source from the first network video recorder. It has taken the full screen. Then there's a remote control. We can change the viewing mode to the court mode. Now the TV is split into four windows. We do have three windows without the video source. Let's continue to connect the second network video recorder to this multi-viewer. Now we have the video source from the second network video recorder. Let's continue to complete the last one. All three network video recorder are ready on this big TV. If you want to choose to watch specific network video recorder, we can use this remote control to select the network video recorder you want to watch. This is the first network video recorder. We also have the second one and the third one. There's different layout. We can even put the one network video recorder on the left and then the rest of the network video recorder on the right. And there also has the lighted picture and picture mode. We have one level video recorder occupies the whole TV and put a small screen to show the last level video recorder at the bottom. We have completed the display of the level video recorder on the single screen. How about the control? As we know, we do need the mouse to control this level video recorder, right? Fortunately, this multi viewer also supports the USB. We can connect the USB port from this network video recorder to this mounted viewers and use just one mouse to control all this network video recorder. Let's make the connection for the USB. There are four USB ports on this multi NVR viewers. I will use this USB cable to connect this USB port to our network video recorder. One thing I want to say is these USB cables are included in the package, but these HDMI cables are not included. Let's make the connection for the first network video recorder. This USB port is corresponding to this HDMI input port. So the first USB port matches the first HDMI port and that will be our first network video recorder. Let's connect the second network video recorder to our second USB port.
and the last network video recorder. We can connect all these three network video recorders to this multi viewer through the USB port. We need one mouse to connect the output port so we can control those three network video recorders. Let's pick the first network video recorder. Uh, we have the mouse, we have the full screen, uh, we can access the menu. Let's pick the second one. And the last one. What if we have the quad mode? Now we've seen all the four network video recorders on the single screen. How can we control or select one of the never video recorders to control? You also need to use the mouse, there's a PC option. Let's say if I want to control the first never video recorder, I choose the first one, PC number one. Then we have the large screen for the first one of the camera on the first window. And we also can pick the first one or control the menu. Now we have the control property for this network video recorder. This one thing quite interesting. Since this multi viewer can take the low voltage power from the USB, if we have connect the USB port from this network video recorder, we can disconnect the power to this multi MVR viewer. We still have the live video on this TV and the controls. This multi MVR viewer will take the DC low voltage power from this USB port. We have seen three network video recorders on this screen, but leave one window black. Can we reuse these black windows? Yes, we can output the video source from the PC computer to the last windows. Let's make it. This is the HDMI cable connected to this computer. Let me connect it to the last HDMI input port. The video source from this computer is output to the last window. Let me choose the last window. Now we have this computer on this big monitor. We have the mouse and the keyboard on this computer. So we can have three never video recorders plus one computer shown on this big TV. The one more feature I didn't test is the audio. Yes, the audio output. If the never video recorder working with the camera, with the microphone, then we can use, connect this audio output to a speaker to hear the voice from this microphone. All right, that's all for today's video. If you have any question, please leave a message in the comment section below.